Pandora does not come on the device out of the box. However, a quick free download in the App Store will give you access to this application. Tapping on the icon will launch Pandora. The first time you open the program, this screen will be displayed, allowing you to sign in to a Pandora account or create a new one. Once you have signed in, the player will automatically start the station you were listening to most recently. To create a new station or switch between your stations, click on the back arrow in the top left corner. Here all of your stations will be listed and you can sort them by date added or alphabetically. Along the bottom are four options, stations, new station, bookmarks, and settings. To add a new station, click on the new station option and type in the name of the artist, song, or composer you wish to create a station around. Here I'm creating a Mozart station. Pandora will automatically switch to your new station. To pause the music, simply press the play pause button located along the bottom. To skip to the next song, press the next button. You also have the option to approve or disapprove a song with a thumbs up and thumbs down. Clicking thumbs up will register that you like the song and Pandora will try its best to play similar songs. If you hear a song you like, you also have the options to bookmark the song or artist, buy it from iTunes, or share the station via email. If you dislike a song, you have the ability to give it a thumbs down, and Pandora will automatically play another song. Songs that you thumbs down will also not be played again on this station. Pressing this icon in the top right corner will display information about the artist and song. Tapping the icon in the top right corner again will return you to the album art if available. You can find songs you bookmarked by accessing the stations page and selecting bookmarks from the bottom. From here, you can also access the settings menu where you have options including higher audio quality, auto screen lock, upgrade to Pandora 1, and you can switch the user signed in or simply sign out.